we are heading to where? Where are we heading? Where else would we go? Goodwill. But what town are we going to? We're going to have. We are up by Lake Erie. We had to check on the camper, so and we're up here. We'll hit this one and probably a couple more today. And we'll look for some estate sales. So we're going to meet someone about noon, and we have an hour. So we're going to go see if we can find any goodies because we have been finding some really good items at Goodwill. We're going to have to start showing you everything that we're finding. First Goodwill of the day, Oregon, Ohio, right next to the Kroger store. What are we going to look for in here? Dishes. What kind of dishes? All kinds. All kinds just never know. We sold a couple hundred dollars worth of dishes just this past week. He's getting a cart. Oh, not. Fight it, fight it, fight it. So you I took another it. one. <laughs> Why fight? Let's go see what we can find. Where are we going first? Yeah, we haven't since summertime. Yeah. All right, well, let's just take a look and see what they have. We've got a lot of Valentine's stuff. A lot of glasses. Hey, what is that? How much do they want for that? Three. Nah, I normally pay a dollar. That is for a revealer. This is old, I think. It is a glass bag. It's peeling, so I'm going to leave that here. And this is that milk glass, the knobby. I just don't think it's something that we would resell. No markings. Mm -mm. It's dirtier than. Looks like it's been microwaved. Yeah, you just gotta watch that stuff. Now, I wanna know this bowl I'm seeing down here with the stripe on it. What brand is that? I always look for Pampered Chef. Made in China. Made in China. Go figure. All right, well, we're gonna look, tell you if we find anything, or we'll show you more when we get to the next aisle. My well, guys, we have a, a situation here. I think we're addicted. Look at all of this glassware. Square Corelware, some false crap juniper. Those are the um, luncheon plates, probably about an eight and a half inch. So, what are you looking up now? Corelware, I didn't know they made stoneware. One with red ins inner line sold for eight bucks. Wow. What all do you got? This is, this is, this is, this is, and more than Lots and lots of listings. Hey, what are we doing? Goodwill number two for number today. Number two, we are in Lima, Ohio, and we will also hit one on the other side of town. They have two, and we're going in here. Guys, Noritake Stoneware. If you ever find it and you're a reseller, you've got to buy it. Check it out. All right, what are we going to find? Oh, got to get a cart. Oh, he's already looking something up. What are you looking up? These are old. I have some listed, so therefore we're not getting any more of those. Fancy, fancy, snazzy. See, they're doing the bundling thing. Looky here. More Corelware. 
$2.99, that makes them a dollar a piece. How can I resist? So what are you finding out about your Coke bowls? I'm doing research and Okay, what have you found out about these Coca-Cola They're listed, bowls? two of them's listed for $19, $17.05 shipping, but people are selling them for eight bucks for two. For two? Yeah. And that brings the price down for everyone else. Kind of hurts other people. They, they, they find them, what they're doing is find them in storage units and just put them on there to make a couple bucks. So how much are these here? $1.99. $2, this, so how can we go wrong? Two taped together. All righty. Just couldn't not buy anything, could we? She's got an addiction. I need AA? AA. Hey, hey, hey. You uh, need four A's, not that All right, way. so let's get in this truck and go to the next one, can we? Oh my gosh, what are we? Number three. Number three. Let's go see what we can find to make a profit. Well, what are we going to find here? You know, these are Corel, but no one wants these little coffee cups like this. And that is False Craft. Again, they're for the saucers for coffee cups. I don't know what brand this is. Let's see how they're doing the bundling. Well, Jim just found these serving bowls, and they are False Craft, so he is doing a little research. But there's not much glassware here that is anything that we would resell. But you never know. If you don't stop, you're always wondering, should I have stopped? I don't know about that mixing bowl set, but man, that would be... You'd have to wrap them each individually, even though they're in the box. They are a return pattern. Alright, so he says they're a retired pattern. What do you have in your hands? More dishes. I'm hardly sure. Some salt and pepper shakers that are brand new. Um, next stop, Wapakoneta. up this morning at 6 a.m. It's almost 6 p.m. now. We are back on the highway heading south to go home. But you know if we're not going home, we're going to more Goodwills. You want to do more? More. More. You heard him folks. More. Is this deja vu? No, it's number four. Number four? Number four. Number four. Finding anything? Dishes. Dishes. Look at all this. Again, they're bundling. Okay, you see that one with the chip? That will go in the flea market, but there's nine of them there. We'll do a recap on this. Looky here. I found a caboodle. And Jim is looking up some probably those Pyrex over there. What are you finding? Lamps. Lamps? Why do we need lamps for? I don't know. Okay, we got an addiction. But look at the Taz cookie jar. And all of this. We'll show you more on the recap. Oh my gosh, he threw something in there I didn't see. What did I throw in there? That is. Oh yeah. Gotta watch him. They're corning we're not. Really? Yeah. Cool. What are we doing now? Welcome to Goodwill number five. And guess what? We're in Piqua, Ohio, and it is my hometown. Let's go shop. Hope we can find some good stuff in here. We found good stuff everywhere we've been. Look at this. Look at the box lots. And we know that's False Craft. That's T Rose. Here's some more here. And that's $5.99, and there's four dinner plates there. But I don't know what is all in here and you've got to watch for this here guys look at the flowers aren't those pretty but they're selling these but all the goodwills are doing this now now here i will avoid these see these corral wear these are not going to be able to get clean they're not worth reselling so remember that 
Let's see what else Jim is finding. He is looking. Lots and lots of glassware. Found some Noritake. These are $1.99 each, but four of them are selling for about 40 bucks. So we've got six. All right, it's time to pay. How much do you think we spent? Mm -hmm. I don't think so, because those dishes weren't that much in that box, were they? Mm -hmm. I bet we spent 25. All right, how much did you say you thought we spent at Pick One? Quit honking that horn. <laughs> 50. Why did I say? 25. 32 is what we spent. Right in between. Mm, I think I won. Now, let's go, win. let's go to Bob Evans and let's get some Din Din. He thinks he's starving. Hangry. You're hangry. Let's go have dinner. I think we got a problem. What kind of problem? Or you got a problem. Oh, listen to him now. What kind of problem? Uh, as you can see, there's dishes here. We went out. But they saw we went to five stores. We went to five stores. Do they have AA for this stuff? We might need AA for this stuff. But we spent $125. We stand and make over $800 in sales with what we bought. Yeah. That's not going to happen overnight and it may take six months to make it 800 bucks 800 but you know that's 800 dollars. that's well you take the 800 in sales yes there are fees on ebay and deduct the 125 in the fees Let's say we end up with 600 yeah that's what i was thinking hey you know at least we ain't got a store and the cost of the store exactly the overhead of the store so i would rather pay the fees to ebay then have to commit to running a store because that's not why we do this for. So, guys, are you ready to see what all we bought? Just show them. All right, well, you know I like to sell Corelware, and I've got a set of six here, and these are the square. And you probably saw that these came, and I can remember where some things came from, not all. We were in Oregon, Ohio, because we were still up around our camper at the lake after we checked on it. And those plates, along with these, which are the luncheon plates, and I have um, 10 of these. I'm gonna do a set of four and a set of six. 50 cents a piece for all of, you know, each for all of these. So I couldn't pass up the corral wear. I've never seen a Goodwill at 50 cents a piece. And another store, what did you find? Found Mikasa, and you know, give me one. Of we these. got four dollars in all four, you know, dollar a plate. These will sell for at least thirty dollars. So, what is the pattern? And to, I can't even say. It. Oh, I'm gonna break it. Is what I'm gonna do. All right. So you saw me try to break something. And he's got, look, inside he's got Bus a crust. <laughs> I call it. it's a that, butter dish. Well, you could call it a rounded covered butter slash cheese, cheese dish. dish. And it is called, Ma I've never <coughs> seen this print. This print is mountain shadow with the purple, the green, and the beige. So, you know, that could be anywhere from $30 or best offer of 20 to 25 Who knows? And she's got more false craft. What's that one? I think that pattern is heirloom. She hasn't looked it and up yet. And we paid three dollars. And how many are there? There, there was nine, but we found a one chip. One was chipped, one. and so here I'll pick these up. I'm only going to pick one up. There are four of these, and this is false craft tea rose. And I have four of these listed. We have four of them here, and these can sell for anywhere from twenty six ninety nine. Offers are twenty, so. Hey, can't go wrong every time you make a $20 sale plus shipping. Now these are the False Craft Juniper print. All these different prints, you really gotta look this stuff up. I have three of them here. Now, I already have three listed on eBay. I've taken the listing down because now this is gonna turn into, you see my note there, six of them. We're gonna change the listing to six. They're more apt to buy six versus three. Then we got three more Corel, and this one's called the square, brown square print. 
and we geometric page, brown squares. Okay, geometric brown squares. I can say that word. <laughs> and we paid three dollars, and she got it listed for you know, fourteen with a ten dollar offer. Normally, those are a dollar a piece. Um, I didn't know these are Corel. I didn't know Corel had a stoneware, and it is called Hearthstone. Now, we paid a dollar for this. I'm not listing it yet. I'm gonna hope to find more in this print because we have a container that I keep things that, especially Corel wear, you look for, might come up with one plate, two plates. Then by the time you know it, you've got enough to sell as a set. Then we got, this, this is Oneida stoneware. It's black and green bowl. And it Mandalay. And it is, yeah, Mandalay. Yeah, I think that's a neat bowl. I'd like to have a set of those. You know, we paid two dollars for it, and she's uh, twelve ninety nine or nine dollars. Nine dollar offer. Nine dollar offer. So of course we found Corelware, and this is called Green Basket Weave. So I've never seen this print before. We have three dollars in the plates, a dollar a piece per plate, three of them, listed for twenty six ninety nine, twenty dollar best offer, and plus shipping. And we got a nine and three quarter inch false craft mountain shadows uh, serving bowl. Paid three dollars, nineteen ninety nine, or fifteen dollar offer. Okay, here are, and I've sold these many a times. These are the Juniper by False Craft, and they are a soup or pasta bowl with a wide rim. And we have three dollars in these. And since I only have two. I'm gonna ask $22.99 and 18 on sh um, offers. Just pull one of those. And I'll pull one of these. This is False Craft Winsong dinner, 10 inch dinner plate, pink and blue flowers. She's got it for $24.99, $19.99, or $20 offer, I think. $19, nine, $19 offer, and okay. she only paid two. Two dollars okay. for we ten plates. We have t no. We paid ten dollars for ten plates. Right. So um, I have one listing for four, another listing for two, and then when we sell the four, I'll relist four more. Four more. So um, now I know exactly what these are. These are the false craft tea rows. We got four of them. Paid thirteen dollars for them. They're listed for nineteen ninety nine or fifteen dollar best offer. And by the time you guys see this video on Wednesday, most of this will be listed in our eBay store. And this is the dessert plate for the uh, Winsong salad plates, Foxcraft. She's got them listed. She got four of them listed for twenty two ninety nine and fifteen dollars. And we got. I think eight of them, and we paid two dollars for them. Yeah. Now Jim found these, and I have never seen these. Before. I have never seen these eat. I've seen the white ones, but I've never seen the. And there's so far I haven't found a listing on. I didn't know it was corning. These are corning wear, and what are they called? Grab it. Grab it. I guess because you can grab it. So they're listed. Nineteen ninety nine or twelve dollars. Well, it's time to clear the table and go get some more. There's more. Oh my gosh, there's more. There's Don't more. go anywhere. And more. And more. 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 What do you have now? Well, this was a a decent find. It's a style home, and. That's what, 10 inch plate, 10 and a half inch plate? That's China. China. We paid $2 for them. And we got four of them. And they're listed for 40 bucks. This is the Goodwill that was in Oregon, Ohio that all their plates for 50 cents. My gosh, how am I gonna stay out of there when we're up at the camper? All I'm gonna wanna do is go to Goodwill in Oregon. <laughs> we got four plates. Four eight and a half inch soup salad bowls. And also she's got, we got $2 in the salad bowl. Mm -hmm. She got four listed for $28.99, $20 office. office. Oh, the office. <laughs> Is yeah. it going to the office? It's going to the office. 
and she got a 10 inch serving bowl. Would you, 50 a cents. cereal bowl. 50 cents. 50 cents. She's got $18.99 and $12 for uh, offers. All right. Well, these are a juniper, which are a bread or dessert plate at six and three fourths inches. Um, again, false craft. I have six of them listed for six, $36 and $30 um, offer. And I go by the prices that they suggest on eBay. And so then I have four, which these will be for $22.99 or an $18 offer. And of course, another juniper pattern. It's more of a luncheon eight, plate. Uh, luncheon plate, salad plate, eight and a half yeah. inches. She's got, uh, we got four dollars in them. <laughs> and $29.99 or $22 offer. Now there's two of these. We had to pick them up because Coca-Cola Coca -Cola sells. Again, a dollar a piece, two dollars in them. And they are from... I thought I had a date on here. It's on the back here. 2001. Coca-Cola Cafe. They're listed for $19.99 or $15 best offer. And again, $2 purchase. And of course, more false craft. This is a Village View purple green, a purple blue green, nine and a half inch serving bowl. We got two of these. They're on for $21.99, $15, and they was uh, $2 a piece. Um, I've never seen this pattern. That's what I want to say. I've I, never seen it, so you, I really had to look up the pattern. Um, this, I think, is so pretty. These are a Noritake, and we have a six-piece set of these. Home Craft by Noritake Fruit Canyon Pattern salad plates and they have an item number of 9234 these are made in korea i have the six of them listed for 49.99 and offers of 40. we also got a salt and pepper shaker from libby uh what's that say clarion 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 19.99 or 15 dollars and we've got four bucks in it yeah i normally don't buy salt and pepper shakers because i don't but do it's so, new in the pack but i don't do so well selling it but none of these have sold but there's only one other listed so why not take a chance for four bucks um okay let's go back some years here this probably goes to the 80s who remembers the caboodles not me well not you but it's a makeup thing My daughter probably had it, but I don't remember it. Okay, we'll kind of hold that. So this comes up like that. Now, what gets really interesting here, I paid $4 for this. I gotta show you this. Can you see that tag? It says Hills. Who remembers Hills stores? In the Ohio area. In the I don't Ohio know if area. Was anywhere else. Because that goes back. I know that they closed sometime in the 80s. Yeah. And so it still has the original tag that it was purchased for $14.97. These are going for $25 to $30 on eBay. It is a little faded, so we'll see how it goes. Couldn't resist it. If not, we have great dollars. 40 years old. I'd be faded too. See, I'm faded. <laughs> That's hereditary. Looky here, the Tasmanian mm, Devil, a cookie, cookie jar. jar. I laid the note there on those plates, so if you can handle that. So, 1993 Warner Brothers. It's nice inside. I'm going to show I, you one. I column. forget what we paid for it, but she five dollars. She we paid five dollars for it and she's got it listed for $38.99 or $30 offer. And I listed it low, lower than the others because. It's got there's a couple chips. There's one chip. Oh, there is two. Oops. Two chips. You were pointing at one, so I knew there was two. <laughs> I was not seeing double-sided. So anyways, when the lid is on it... You can't see the chip. You don't see the chip. I have put that in the description, but I will go back and make sure I add to the review. I always tell them to please review all pictures, and that way... Um, 
kind of covers your behind. So what do you think? $125, potential of over $800 in sales. I don't think we did bad. I don't think we did bad either, but I want you guys to leave a comment below. Let us know what you think. And what do we want to ask them? Don't forget to subscribe. Hit, hit the notification bell. Hit the thumbs up. Share, 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 share. Because, you know, we well, have fun doing it. We but, do. You know, I, I love to have a storage unit. But we got outbid yesterday. We got so outbid yesterday, then found out that it got canceled anyway. So hopefully the owners paid for it and they got their merchandise back. But as he says, it'll probably be back up on auction a month from now. So thanks for watching, guys. Bye. See you next Wednesday. Love you all. Bye-bye.